Hi, I'm Michael Carson with Exercise TV. I've got a quick cardio blast workout for you that's going to work you from top to bottom. Tone your glutes, trim your waistline, and tone your arms all at the same time. Now we're going to start with some hand weights. All you're going to need is one to begin with, and I want your feet about shoulder width apart. Now bring your elbows to your knees for me. Bring your hips straight back. You got that? And then you're going to tuck them underneath you. Buns nice and tight. We're going to do that a little bit faster. Here we go. Taking it down one time and tuck it underneath. Now we're going to take it to tempo. Going one and two. As you're coming up, I want you to exhale. As you go down, breathe in nice and deep so you're getting lots of oxygen for those muscles. We're going to be working the hips, the glutes, the hamstrings, and the thighs to start with. And they take a lot of energy. You're going to bring up your heart rate. Now watch the arms. I want you to take them from here to the top. As the arms go up, you're squeezing your glutes, breathing in and exhale. Nice work. You got one more set like this. Give me eight times and up. Seven. Nice and stretched out. Six. Good. Just four more. We're going to add a little twist to this. Same squat. We're going to add a twist. Just two more times. Two. Now watch. I'm going to come off to the one side now. Coming here and then back to the middle. Opposite side. So I'm still squatting right back, but I'm not bringing any shoulders across the body. In doing that, I'm warming up more of the core, getting more of the waistline involved. Bring it around. Good, you can hear my voice starting to labor. My heart rate's going up as well. You got eight more like this. Seven, good. Six, and we're gonna change the move. Four more times now. Four, reach it. Last two. One more time. Now put the weight in that left hand and bring the elbow down to the knee and stretch straight up. This time, breathe out as you go down. Inhale as you come up. Two more slow. Breathe out. And in. So you're stretching to the rib cage. One more time like this. Here we go. Tempo. Same move. Exhale. Breathe it in. Good. Nice and tall. Pushing through your heels. Stretching that arm straight to the sky. Down. Good. Seven more. Six. Feel that heart rate? I'm starting to sweat. Hope you are. You got four more to go. Three. Two. Other hand, now slow it down again. I want you to go slow, breathe. In as you come up. Nice and slow, exhale. Breathe in, just two more like that. Bring it down, hips back. And just one more time. Good, nice and strong, pressing to the heels. Same thing at tempo speed, here we go. Down, bring it up. Down, inhale on the way up, exhale on the way down. Each time, stretching through the rib cage, nice and tall. Eight, and seven, good. Six. You got one more set of four. I'm going to change the move again, warming the whole body up. Two more times. All right, last one. We're going to hold the dumbbell with both hands. Now watch. We're going to take it here and stand up, and here and stand up. Two more like this. One more time. Here we go. A little faster now. Bring the hips back. Hips back. As you're going back, all the weight's going through the heels, through the hips. My shoulders are crossing the center of the body, making that body have to swing to the midsection. That's right, the core, waking it up. One more set. Give me going now. Eight. Good. Just four more times. We're going back to a single arm movement. We're going to put the dumbbell on the left hand. Come here. Tuck underneath. Take it down. Underneath. We just work the sides of the body. Now we're going back through the center. One more set. You got eight. Tuck it under. Don't forget about the buns. Every time, nice and tight. Looking good. Four more. Four. Good. Three. Last two times. We're gonna change your arms now. Other side. Bring it down. Tuck it under. Down. Tuck it under. Good. Nice and strong. Get one more set of eight. I want you to feel those buns pressing through the heels. Seven. Good. Six. One more set of four. Then we're gonna put both arms on the dumbbell, keeping the same move. Last two. Excellent. Now watch the move. The feet are gonna come together. Come down. Together, back to the heels, nice and tall, down. Good, one more set, you got four, and three, two, last time. Excellent, hold it right here, bring the feet apart. Want the right hand on the bottom, left hand on the top. Want the shoulder facing forward. Now this shoulder faces forward, come left. Good, nice, side to side, one, Two, you're ready, we're gonna speed it up, stomach tight. Cross the body. Now notice the weight. It's perpendicular to the ground the whole time. And I'm tightening those abs to resist that movement from side to side. Really waking up the core. Take it across, cross. One more set, keep it going now. Eight, good, six, keeping those legs bent. Four, 
Three, two, last one. Gonna hold it on this side. Turn it over now. Opposite hands on top. Come across with the shoulder. Come across, let's go to tempo. Cross it, cross it, good. Nice and strong, shoulders back, chest up tall. Two more sets of eight like this. Your abs have to be engaged, but don't hold your breath. Four, three, one more set, last eight, eight. Looking good, four more, four, three, two, last one. Awesome, we're gonna go down to the ground. I want you to keep the weight close by. Going to the floor, we're gonna do a push-up. Now, a lot of you say to me, I can't do push-ups. Today, you can do push-ups. We're gonna do what's called a dolphin push-up. I want your hands wider than your shoulders and your feet come off the ground. I want you to bring your toes to the ground. Tighten your stomach as the feet touch the ground. Now watch, one and two. As the feet touch the ground, you lift the body up. So take it up and then you come down. Watch the feet. Push and down and again. Push, so as my toes hit the ground, my body just lifts right up. Nice and tall, and down, good. This is a way to be able to learn how to do push-ups if you've never done them on your toes, because a little action with the feet causes your stomach to contract, giving you health as you come up. And down, and again, lift. We got one more set. Hang in there, just four more counts. Four, and down, good. Three, and down, two more counts. Two, that feels good to me. One more time, and one. Staying right here, I want you to come down to your forearms now. Hold in a plank position with your hips tucked underneath. Just want you to hold it there and lift the foot and lower the foot. Other side, lift the foot and lower the foot. Now a little faster. One, two, squeeze the glutes as you lift that leg. Keep your leg nice and long, nice and strong. Abs engaged and hips tucked underneath. Everything's pressed firm to the forearms. One, two, two more to go. Three, last time. Four, I want you to bring your knees down, stretch back. Just two breaths and we're gonna turn over onto the back. All right, turn on your back for me. What I want you to do is bring the knees together, bring the feet together and the hands next to you on the sides of the floor. You're gonna pull the knees to the stomach only using your abs, no momentum. So squeeze them in and then touch the floor. Just squeezing them in and touch the floor. No momentum now, pulling those knees in and down. You feel that? Working those lower abs. And make sure your knees are pinned together. We got four left. In and down, good. Bring it in and down. Two more times. Two and one more time and one. Excellent, just take one second, lift the hips up. Take a single breath and then drop the hips down. I want you to straighten out both legs. With your legs stretched, I want your butt pressed to the ground. You're gonna take your right arm and the other arm. You're gonna lift up to the top and down to the bottom, you see that? I'm pressing the hand to the ceiling, bringing the other hand to the outside, making my obliques have to work as I come up. And again, you got four, good. Three, pressing the back to the ground, each repetition, and exhale on the way up. And one more time like this, one, and down, and again, bend the legs, you want the knees together, feet together, hands on the ground, and pull it in, and down, one more set, in, and down, looking good. Breathe out as you pull the knees in, touching the floor each repetition. You got two more like this, just one more time, that's one, and down, straighten out the legs for me again. This hand comes up this time. All this hands out to the side. You're gonna lift and down, and again. Lift and down, looking good. Up, one more set, give me four more like this. Four, and down, three, and down. Two more times, two, good. Just once more, and one. Awesome, bring it all the way down to the floor, bending the legs. You're gonna bring your feet together and your knees together for one more exercise on the ground. Arms come out to the sides. Simple tick-tock move, watch. Coming towards me with the knees and the ankles pinned together. Now go away, away from me. Excellent, we got one small set of these to go. All the way over. Knees stay pinned together and back. Good, two more times in each direction. Take it over. One more time. 
One more time towards me, please. Hold on there and take it back. Excellent, we're gonna bring it back into the center. Take the knees right into the chest and hold them there for me. Great, now we're gonna come back up. I want you to grab your hand weight, bring your feet together, take the hands above the head, nice and tall, and we're gonna bring the elbows to the knees and then step back together. You got that? Here we go. Down and lift. As you go back, the hips are leading the way and as you come back up, tuck those glutes in, breathe out. Breathe in, so as you're breathing in, you're stretching the waistline. Every single rep, hips back. Good, one more set. You got four more. Four, three, two. Now we're gonna change direction, other side now, same thing. Bring it down, making sure that those elbows touch the knees every rep. Down, tuck the buttons underneath each rep. Give me eight more now, eight. Good, seven, breathing in, six, nice and tall. Four more counts, four, good, three, two. Now we're gonna alternate from side to side. Here we go, other side, down and up. Hips back, every time, straight back. Nice and smooth, looking good. Down, good, down, down. You have one more round, give me eight more counts. Last set of eight, hang in there, eight. Breathe in, exhale, good, six, and five, four to go. Four more, then we're gonna go back to those figure eight squats. Last two. Once more. Good, now bringing the feet apart. Hands are still on the weight. You're gonna come down, down, pulling it back from the knees to the hips, and you're tightening those abs as you come around. Push, good, to the heels. Now your heart rate's gonna come up a little bit more with this one, that's what I want. Spiking that heart, here we go, back. Nice and smooth, see how my shoulders are relaxed. Just rolling from side to side. Give me eight more. Good. Last four, three, two, now hold it here. Come around, touch the hip, come around. As I'm coming around, I'm really forcing that weight around to stretch the waistline. And that opposite heel, as you can see, comes off the ground at the end of the movement, so there's no stress on the knee, no stress on the ankle. One more set, good. Seven, six, and five. Four more times. Four, three, two, last one. Bring the weight right here and lift. As you're lifting, I want you to squeeze your stomach nice and tall. Shoulders stay up, chest stays up. You got one more set like this. Four, three, two. Now the arm's gonna stay at the top. Keep the arm up, now watch. Pull the arm down as the knee comes up, keeping the body nice and tall, squeeze. Tight, tight. One more set of eight. You got eight and six. Good work. Four, three, two, last one. Touch the hip, swing around. How you feeling? My heart rate's up and I'm gonna keep it there until we're done. Keep it going, nice and strong. You got 11 more like this and around, making sure you can see the back side of your shoulder. Every single rep, give me eight more. Eight, seven, looking good. And four more to go, nice and strong. Push back to the hip. Nice and strong to that heel. Two more, and one, hold it here. Now press, squeeze that stomach. Press, a couple more. Two, now keep the weight at the top this time. Now watch the arm and leg, pull. Pull, shoulders stay tall, squeezing those abs. Down, down. Give me eight more, same thing, here we go. Eight, nice, six, four, three, two, last one. All right, we're going back down to the ground, putting the weight down, coming down to the floor. We're gonna do a tricep push up this time. This time you're gonna stay on your knees. Whether you're thinking strong, whether you're not strong at all, I want you to do the same. We're gonna come down to the floor, elbows pinned to the body. We're gonna press up and come down. One more time, slowly. Press up and then down. You ready? A little faster. Breathe out, inhale. See how my feet are off the ground. Pivoting directly on the knees. Nice and strong. Bring it up, here. Good, here, nice and tall. All the way through the arms, extending back to the triceps. One more set of four. Four, three, two, and one, stretch back. 
We're not done. We got one more set the exact same way. Now that you know what we're doing, I want you to put more pressure into those triceps. Make sure you're breathing, keeping your stomach tight. One more breath. You ready? Here we go. Starting from the bottom. Hands, elbows close to the body. You're gonna push up, breathing out. Come down, breathing in. Push up, breathing out. Here we go, tempo, eight counts now. Eight, and down. Seven, and down. Six, nice and strong. Your whole body comes up in one straight line. Four more, three more, two, and one. Excellent, sitting up, you're gonna grab your hand weights. Lie back onto your back. I want your feet flat on the ground, the lower back flat, and the arms up. Now we'll simply, we're gonna take these arms and let them bend, bringing the weights back. And then extend to the top. You got that? Right angle at the elbows. Take it one and two. Making sure that as you do this, you're tightening the abs as you press up. Breathing every repetition. Take it back and lift. Back, very strict with this form. Don't let the elbows move at all. Just the forearms are doing all that moving. Down and up, down. Making sure as those elbows bend, that they're pointing straight toward the ceiling. As your back press to the ground, are your abs tight? Keep checking that out, every repetition. Now watch, I'm gonna add a little twist on the way up. Down, and then palms twist. And then palms twist. Now this weight was light when it started. It's starting to get heavy. We don't wanna use a heavy weight because we're not trying to build bulky arms. We're trying to build nice toned arms. And across. This time, low straight again. Straight up, good. Straight back and up. One last set. You got four more after this one. That's four. How you feeling? Are you tired yet? I hope so. Because we're gonna change the move. Last one, hold it here. Bring the elbow to the rib cage. As close to the body as you can. So now we're working a little bit deeper in the tricep and the shoulders. Bring it straight to the floor and as you press up, I want that stomach to engage. Down, press, down, press. One more set of eight. Seven, six, think about that stomach, think about that back and breathe the whole time. The more breath you get, the more you're gonna get out of it. One more time, hold it right here. Now I want the palms to face your feet. Now watch, I'm gonna take the outside hand and bring it down to the chest and then back up, opposite side. Down to the chest and up, other side. Down to the chest and let's go a little faster now. Here we go, one. Two, so the arm, once again, is nice and stationary, only the forearm's doing the movement. Working a little bit different part of the tricep, so we're creating a nice whole outer arm, not just one part of it, getting the whole thing all together. One more set, 12, and 11, 10. Hang in there, eight more, eight, seven. Press that back firm to the floor, each rep. Four more counts, here we go. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent, why don't you take those weights, gently put them off to the side. Put them off to the side and bring your knees up for me. Hands go behind the head. Now watch me, keeping the knees together, I'm gonna crunch all the way up and slowly all the way down. As I'm crunching, the elbows come in. As they go down, they come nice and wide. Bring it in, exhaling up, breathe in as you go down. Take it out and in once again. Bring it up, good. I really feel this one, I hope you do. Up and down, good. We're gonna do one more like this. And hold the legs up, bring the arms out to the side. Head is on the ground now. And I want you to the legs fall towards me again, doing that tick-tock motion. Hold it right there, knees pinned together, ready? Take it over the top to the other side. Want the stomach tight and those knees still pinned together and back towards me. Excellent, keep that pace going, knees together all the way over the top. Looking good, and back again, here. Wonderful. Every time you're going across, I want you to be aware of your stomach, keep it engaged and across. We got one more set of four, last set. Four, beautiful. Three, two more. One more towards me and one more away. Excellent, all the way across, beautiful. Take it right here. I want you to bring the knees into the stomach for me. Take two breaths. One more time. Dropping those legs down. Cross the top leg over the bottom leg. 
bringing the hands together on the knees and pull it to the chest. Now that workout got you from top to bottom, from the midsection all the way to the arms, from the toes to the top of the head. You're gonna drop the feet down and change the stretch. And I wanna make sure though, that when you're done with this workout, you get a little food, get some extra water, because it takes a lot more out of you than you think. You're gonna keep that workout going when you're done. You got two more breaths. One more time. Excellent. Uncross the legs, I want you to rock it two times on the back. And then go ahead and sit all the way up. Excellent. I'm Michael Carson, that was your Cardio Blast workout, and this is Exercise TV.